Hi guys, welcome back to my mother's channel. I'm doing my bi-weekly Misfits Market delivery update. If you've been following us, you'd see that I started getting these deliveries a couple of months ago. Um, every other week. And I'd just like to go through the box with you and see if we like what we got. This was an add-on. This is organic granola from Grandy Oats. It's one pound. It was $4.99. I believe Grandy Oats is the same brand that we get the nuts from when we order them. So I got that because in our local stop and shop here, granola runs up to $10 a bag. I got this two for eight dollars it's almost a pound 15.5 ounces and that was about three weeks ago and that was actually the first time that I really even ate granola I mean I've had it before but it's not something that I eat so I learned to like it in yogurt or I even put it in a little bit of in a bowl with a little bit of jam on top and warm it <laughs> we went upstate a while ago and I got some Drunken cherry jelly, and it actually had whole cherries in it. And I put that on the granola and warmed it with a little bit of salted caramel sauce, and it tasted like a cherry pie. So we got this bunch of um, carrots with the tops on them. If you know anything, I won't throw these away yet. If you know anything I can do with these tops, or put it in a smoothie, let me know. So we have about seven carrots there. I guess that's what they call a baby carrot. So again, I did the um, I'm now selecting what I want in the bag. That They just started that about a month ago. Um, so there I have three categories. The first two categories, you pick five, and the last one you pick two. Some of them... Sometimes when you're picking them, they've already run out of certain selections, but I decided that I do like to choose um, because it might be items that I need at that time instead of waiting to get more red apples <laughs> that we don't even eat. So this, I think, was a mixed head of lettuce. It's small, but like I told you before, I don't know what it is, some kind of head of lettuce. And look, it even has the roots on it. I buy lettuce, and then I don't eat it right away, and then it goes bad on me. And do you believe that that Several boxes back, I got kale, endive, and then the box after that I got frisee and the green pea shoots, and I still have them, and they're still fresh. So I think I'm going to go that route more on my salads than just regular lettuce. Used to, I would take the lettuce and clean it and chop up the cucumbers and everything else to put in it and um then it ends up going bad on me so now I'm just making I make it when I'm ready to eat it so I'll make like two bowls for tonight and then I'll make it again tomorrow I can't remember what this is it looks like Swiss chard green Swiss chard but I don't remember picking green Swiss chard. Yeah. That says chard. The other side says green. So maybe they didn't have what I picked. and um, Or maybe I did pick it. I don't know. I don't really like how these green stalks look brown. But I'm going to make the best of it. The box did come a day late. They sent me an email saying that it was packaged on Sunday. Usually it would be, I guess, 
I don't know if it's packaged on Saturday and delivered Monday, but they said it would be a day late and it was packaged on Sunday and kept in their coolers. So that might be why it's brown or maybe it's just on its way out. I think this is tomatoes. tomatoes guys if you leave if you leave what are those things called a family? comment no those things that were in seeds yeah. if you leave seeds in a pump in a pumpkin and you carve them out bugs will get in them well, we're going to put the pumpkin outside. Bugs are going to eat them if, if you put them outside and, and they have seeds in them. So that I got a zucchini. I didn't really want another zucchini. I'm kind of burnt out on them. But in that section, there was nothing else to choose. So I got an onion. I got lemons and limes. I use them a lot in my water, and they, they keep for a long time. Oh, I got, I think this is parsnip. <clears throat> Not much, but maybe I can cook it with the carrots. Now. He wants to show you his pumpkin seeds. I'm going to roast those. No, I'm done. Oh. What? My cucumber got cut in half. Uh, that's cool. Still looks healthy. We'll see. I got celery. Eat some of the pumpkin seed. I put celery in my water too. This was an add on my coffee. I didn't get that for a while. <clears throat> oh, cilantro, which I use to make my seasoning. Oh, three lemons, three limes. Lemons! And a huge squash? <laughs> yeah, a huge butternut squash. I just made soup today. It would have gone good in the soup. Um, oh, and my ginger. Ginger? And that's all, but okay. little, for little crumbs and like little vegetables. Um, and, and there's like... A I feel like I had a piece of... Sh I feel like I had another add-on, but... I can't remember if any of this produce is an add-on. I don't think it is. I guess it was just the granola and the coffee. So, although I'm not happy with that Swiss chard, I'll probably complain. They might throw me something extra in um, my next box. So anyway, tell me what to do with the butternut squash. I baked, cut it in half and baked it before. One side I did salt and pepper. One side I did cinnamon and sugar. And I didn't really care for it. Maybe I didn't cook it long enough. Um, so I have been enjoying trying out all these new squash. <laughs> and I do like them. So uh, acorn squash I ended up putting in soup before I had gotten the messages to bake it, but it was good in the soup. We like to put a little pumpkin in the soup every now and then. In fact, I was really considering putting those guys in my soup today, <laughs> but I didn't. All right, so all in all, not bad for $22, and that was also with a discount, so thank you whoever subscribed and put in my code. I got the 25% discount. So I guess that was basically free shipping. So the code today under this video is for you to get 30% off and then I get 50% off because they're trying to expand. Particularly, they said they are now in Utah. So I don't know how long that code is good for. They did say it was temporary. So I don't know, maybe for seven days or something. All right. So if you subscribe, I hope you enjoy it as much as we do. However, I do understand it's not for everybody, but um, 
for now. It's working out good for us. So thank y'all for watching. Keep coming back and enjoy your week.